Following some developing news up north in Vermont, where that state is dealing with the aftermath of really some catastrophic flooding here. Check this out. Many streets in Mount Pelier now underwater tonight. A dam upstream from the capital city there is holding at maximum capacity. Officials, though, fear what could happen if it fails. Now, Okemo Mountain Resort in the town of Ludlow, Vermont, also a disaster zone tonight. With so many roads closed, it's very hard to get in or out of town. Channel 3's Dylan Fear and did manage to get in and is showing us the damage. This is downtown Ludlow, Vermont. We're on Main Street. It was a very long day for crews as they start fixing this injured community. It may be broken physically, but not broken with spirit. Their attitude is fantastic. The only way to fix this is to get to work, and it starts with repairing Main Street. Great, and I've never seen anything like this. What Richard Moore sees is the popular subway on Main Street ruined. It moved across the parking lot off its foundation. It, 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 uh, it actually floated like a boat would float. Uh, it, it was 24 feet this way on these pylons right here. And uh... the damage so bad, so shocking, a mother and two young kids have to walk through broken road to get home. Drone 3 shows you Main Street from up above. Meanwhile, these guys are busy getting their beloved truck out of the mud. Behind this powerful brook, Don Hancock's new garage was destroyed by giant trees and rushing water. Oh yeah, we watched it. We, I sat right on the back porch and watched everything. He watched as his beautiful retirement home flooded. He just moved to Vermont. One came here to retire, and I guess this is my retirement present. <laughs> This man falls and nearly hurts himself trying to dig a broken trailer out. Jay Genova has a great attitude, though. Just pieces of metal. There's nothing that can be replaced. Pretty quiet on Main Street now. The crews are gone. Some cars going by as safely as they can. Those crews have a tough day tomorrow. They'll be back here in the morning. So will we. In Ludlow, Vermont, I'm Dylan Fear in Channel 3 Eyewitness News.